Well, we've seen how COVID-19 has delivered a powerful punch to the restaurant industry right here in the upstate. Uh, we've seen a lot of struggles uh, in the food industry, so it makes up a lot of downtown. Food and drink businesses, though, are still recovering and looking forward to the upcoming year. A popular downtown event, hoping to help them a little bit, and it's returning to Main Street. Yeah, one of Greenville's biggest celebration of all things food and drinks, Euphoria. It's coming back to the streets of downtown Greenville this fall. And Fox Carolina's Carrie Weimer talked to Euphoria organizers this morning as they announced their lineup. Now, Carrie, what do people need to know about attending and how are they planning to do this safely? Yeah, absolutely. You know, if you've ever been to Euphoria right here in the streets in downtown, you know it's the upstate's largest food and drink celebration. World-renowned chefs, culinary treats, and amazing beverages to wash it all down right here in one spot. But like a lot of things this year, the pandemic's going to have it looking a little different. We're bringing a lot of events that were fan favorites from 2019 back that we weren't able to host last year. But we're also putting together a lot of our smaller, quaint events that people really enjoyed last year. The executive director for Euphoria tells us after having to scale down last year because of the pandemic, they figured out a way to safely hold the four-day food, wine, and music festival this September 16th through the 19th. All the protocols and policies will be in place from masking whenever you move, social distancing, moving as many events outside as possible. So we'll definitely follow all CDC and DHEC regulations as we get into September. Carl Sobosinski, one of the founders of Euphoria, along with singer-songwriter Edwin McCain, told us today the event is not about drawing in bigger crowds with longer lines. It's all about the quality of the venues and the chefs and the talent and the winemakers and the musicians. They're doing such amazing work, obviously drawing tourism, bringing such a strong food culture to our community. It's, it's awesome. It's one of the, I mean, it's one of the funnest things in the world to do, right? Is eat. So everybody can agree with that. It's important to Greenville because it's not only a community event. We want Greenvillians and people from the upstate to come out, but we want to promote Greenville as a tourist destination. Show our culinary and hospitality and industry off and really just give back to our community. Now this event gives you the opportunity to give back to the community. Every dime that you spend down here at Euphoria in September goes to help over 40 local charities. So while you're having a good time, you're also helping other people out. Now, of course, that lineup is too long for me to list right here on air. So we've got a link in our As Seen On section where you can find the events in September for Euphoria. Cody, Jarvis, 